Hello and welcome. The big breaking story at this hour. N. Chandrasekharan of TCS and Ralph Speth of Jaguar and Land Rover have been elevated to the board of Tata Sansa. This was something that we broke right here on CNBC TV 18 first. An exclusive and an official statement has come out. In fact, Ratan Tata, the interim chairman of Tata Sons, has also given a statement saying that this is in recognition of their exemplary leadership in their companies. Uh, Nisha, who got the uh, details of um, the press release uh, before the press release came out, significantly before is here with the details. You know, this is so, Im this is important, you know, putting into perspective the fact that uh, they need loyalists with them at this point in time. They need old Tata hats at this point in time. And let's not forget, uh, N. Chandrasekharan is one, is one of the rumoured contenders, completely media speculation, but rumoured contenders uh, to be one of the players that is being looked at to be the possible successor as well. But Kritika, it can be also taken as probably rewarding the top uh, performers of Tata Group. And that's the kind of professionalism and the reward that uh, Ratan Tata wanted to bring in as soon as he joined and rejoined as the chairman, interim chairman of Tata Sons. And that he clearly said that leadership position is going to be important. We are not going to um, uh, also touch the businesses. Uh, the transition should not affect uh, the businesses of the group and that leadership should be maintained. And these are probably the candidates, uh, Ralph Speth at GLR as well as N. Chandra at TCS. They both have brought that kind of a leadership and leadership position for their companies as well. So probably on the basis of performance of the companies and of these CEOs, these two appointments have been made also I did gather from sources that uh, uh, Ratan Tata, as soon as he came came in, mm -hmm. wanted to enrich and expand the Tata Sons board so that there is more professionalism, more good ideas and strategy in place in terms of Tata Sons board. Remember, there is also a thinking that the, the probably the group executive council that was constituted by Cyrus Mistry was taking away a lot of powers and strategizing on behalf of Tata Sons board. So it is probably also reinstating the faith and authority in Tata Sun's board by bringing in the shareholders yeah. of Tata Group as well, the ones like uh, N. Chandrasekharan who has been at the helm of TCS for so long and in fact a large part of the net worth of the Tata Group and the value in Tata Group lies with TCS. So he is one person who has been probably rewarded on the basis of performance and so is the case with even JLR CEO Ralph Speth. So these two appointments probably could be purely on the basis of um the performance and the reward given on the basis of performance. But nonetheless, it expands uh, the board now in the last few months from uh, the time uh, Amit Chandra, uh, Venu Srinivasan, as well as Ajay Piramal were brought in as outside professional uh, thinkers and the think tank was created. And now the inside resources who have performed well, mm -hmm. it could be a very heady mix and a very good thinking cap and think tank for Tata Sons going forward. Forward for ta to take forward the strategy of the and you group. know